What would you cite as the most important reason for your early success with small amounts of capital? And given hindsight today, what might you have done to improve your strategy with these small funds? Yeah, well, I had a great teacher. I had exceptional focus. And I had the right sort of uh, uh, emotional uh, qualities that that would help me in being an investor. I enjoyed the game. I mean, if it, you know, it, it's just about, you know, hard enough to be interesting, but not so, so hard as to be beyond the capabilities of people understanding it. And, and that's kind of the way this game is. I mean, it's, it's, it's not like Henry Singleton kind of questions he took on. It's, a, it, it's, it's actually a pretty easy game, and it does require a certain uh, emotional stability uh, and I, I went at it, you know, hammer and tong. I, <laughs> I went through the manuals and everything, but I was enjoying when I, when I did it. And, and, and like I say, I started out between ages seven and about 19. I had that same enthusiasm, but I didn't really have any guiding principle. And then I ran into the intelligent investor and Ben Graham and, 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 uh, and then at that point, I was able to take all this energy and everything, uh, and enthusiasm for it, and 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 now I had a philosophy that uh, uh, made a lot of sense, total sense, and I found that I could employ, and so the game became even more fun. But it wasn't wasn't really more complicated than that, Charlie. Well, I, I don't have anything to add. I do think that that it's an easy game if somebody has the temperament for it and keeps at it because he likes it and is interesting, interested in it. I have a problem that Warren has less of. I don't like being too much an example to people who want to get rich by being shrewd and buying and passively holding securities. I don't think that's enough of a life. Right? If you rest a fortune from life by being shrewder than other people and buying little pieces of paper, uh, I don't think that's an adequate contribution in exchange for what you're taking. So, so I like it when you're investing money for an endowment or a pension fund or your relatives or something, but, but I, I never considered it enough of a life to merely be shrewd and picking stocks and passively holding them. Yeah, running Berkshire has been far, far more fun than running, in my case, Buffett Partnership or, or, or just an investment fund. I mean, that... You'd see, be less of a man. If you'd be, run it'd, that partnership... It'd be a crazy way to go through life. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, it just, you know, I, uh, Berkshire is incredibly more satisfying. So if you're good at just investing your own money, uh, I hope you'll morph into doing something more. <laughs>